All right, welcome, welcome to Aramella Gaming and uh, whatever. I, of course, am Aramella. We are here today to play RimWorld. Um, last time there was, it was a bit of a rocky, rocky run. We had a death fight. Uh, someone tried to burn down and succeeded in burning down most of our crops over here. She's in jail now, which set off her friend who ended up over here. So, yeah, there was some problems. Um, there was a lot of breakdowns. Everybody left and right was sort of flipping out. We got it a little bit under control. I think our, I think we're still in a bit of a tenuous situation. So hopefully things go okay. I think today our goal is to get this area up. So this is the butcher area kitchen. Uh, food storage and this eventually will be the dining area now I'm not gonna try to dig all of this out today but we'll see how far we can get and this is another priority we need to get this hooked up and then the third thing is to get the fencing finished because the animals can get out over here and they can get out here so that's our priorities for today so let's jump in. All right. So first thing, I'm going to set up a couple things for them to start, and then, then I'll hit play. So structure, fence. So we said over here, right here. And then also, hmm, I guess we'll just go like this. I know I don't need this, but... I want it so I shall have it and I think that was the only place that they can actually get out now because we we put one here so I believe we're all right with that and then we also need let's see it's been a couple days just familiarizing myself with what everybody all right Zorcon construction, Erica plants. All right, let's go ahead and harvest this stuff. Now what I want is also to get batteries. And I wonder how far, not very, look at that, it's right there. So I'm quite far away from being able to get batteries. And I'm tempted to just have Erica, do that. What is wrong with... Let's see. Take her to bed, consume... For some reason, she seems like she's not doing that great to me. Maybe I need to feed her or something. Oh, she's been drinking. All right. Um, hmm. I'll keep an eye on her. I don't want to lose Gorilla. Yeah, see, it doesn't look like she's actually laying in bed to me. It looks like something's slightly off. Hang on a second. I'm not sure exactly what the problem is, but I'm going to go like this. And then have her take her to bed. Oh, no, she can move. All right, she was just standing. All right, never mind, Erica. False alarm. It's okay. But instead, we can haul these because I need to set up the power conduit. So let's get those out of the way. Hooch, um, you, sir, before you do that, I'd like you to mine these three things and then you can go do what you like and you I need over here this is what I want to get done first and this could be the starter the starting point of our kitchen which is very important because people have been getting very sick so it's been a problem she is so pissed Hideous environment, tired, pessimist, pain. 
Okay, yeah, there, there's problems, I agree. Hospitality for a friend. He wants you to host him. We will not do any work. No, dude. Not right now. Maybe in a few days. We'll see. I can barely keep my people together, and if you're not doing work, I cannot have you here right now. Alright, what's this look like? We also need to turn this down a little, because we want this to be a freezer while we're getting this place set up. Yeah, he's getting through it. 40, 44. That's alright. And we need this. Now, I don't know if there's a way to actually select these. Is I know I can click on them and then prioritize, but I don't know if I can click here and then actually prioritize them to where they'll do this first, but... I could micromanage them this way. Uh, needs food. Alright, so when you wake up, eat your food. And then come over here and get this done. And then Hooch, what you doing, buddy? Uh, cooking simple meal. Alright, cook a meal and then do that. And I need... I'm not storing food over here, which they shouldn't be. So hopefully they eat those first. Low food. I know I have, I have lots of problems. Tantrum orange. Well, crud. I was going to say that's not really a problem, except she... <sighs> she broke her door down. So... Zorkun, I need you to, okay, hang on, Erica, I need you to get these trees cut down so Zorkan could build the door so we can rearrest our prisoners. All right. You go do that. And then where are our prisoners? Gorillas not making a run for it right yet. And she's insane, so might be okay. And Zorkan, um, can you maybe help her cut a tree down? No? Alright. She's just wandering, so I think we have time. I'm going to fast forward and see. You broke your stuff. If you break your stuff in there, I'm not making it again, Orange. Not until all their other stuff is up. So this is not helping you. Alright, go make that. That still works as a bed, so I'm not going to... Alright, there's Orange, there's Gorilla, Zorkon's coming, then we'll re-arrest these guys. She's just like talking to her. Alright, so her will is down all the way, which means we can get her now. Which would really help our colony. It's not nice, that's the way it is on RimWorld. Alright, Zorkon, are you fixing the door, dude? Why are you building the chair? Do the door. That's the problem. Could you? Yeah. They won't build if they're in it. So. Alright, so are you caught again? How about you? Let's take her where she's supposed to be. Alright. She's calm. She's okay. Alright. Now, what were we actually meant to be doing? You, what I can do is because I don't actually want them digging this stuff out yet. So, 
there should be a way cancel right there we go to cancel this and so he will focus on this area hopefully all right let's just fast forward you guys can sleep we'll work on it tomorrow The donkey's chilling in here. How did you get in, donkey? How did you get in? Um, I bet this is how they got in. Which means we need another door and a fence. Uh-oh. What's going on? Oh, no. We're okay. All right. So we need another bed here. Build copy. And then Zorcon, did you ever do this over here, buddy? This is important. You did not. All right, well, when you wake up, that's what I need you to do. So you will go eat. That's reserved by Gorilla. How about this one? There you go. You will go eat. Oh, you've already ate. Never mind. Never mind. Don't eat. But I do need you. Okay. Never mind. Hang on. We need some wood. Erica is harvesting a potato plant, so she can come do this. Now she, what can you do? That's one thing, we need to get her stuff set up now. Okay, so you, she has not great handle animal, no cooking skill, but she had great plant skill. Which is why we got her. So you're going to be concentrating on that. Which means I think we have enough help in that area that I can put Erica on research. So for that, or uh, for now, that's what I'm going to do. Erica, go to research, and you, all right, can you make, here, hang on, deliver the wood, and then Zorkon can make you a bed. Where is Zorkon? Hang on, pause, colonist needs rescue, what do you need rescue? Oh, yeah, that's a real problem, food poisoning. I know. Okay. Hang on. You. No. You. Go help her. You. Take care of this problem. And then this problem. And then it seems like the animals will be trapped. All right. And then this problem and lastly this problem and when you get all done with that then you can sleep all right hooch my man what are you doing cooking simple meals You're giving everybody food poisoning it's not your fault I know No, no, oh, I messed up. I meant to have him mine out one more before. All right, Erica is going a little crazy. I've got to start getting cleaned, or uh, getting things cleaned up, too. I didn't want to bring her here. It's because she didn't have a bed here. All right. You're no longer incapable of walking. How bad is your construction? Is it absolutely? It's two. I mean, it's no worse than everybody else that's not Zorkon. So, 
once you get, once you eat, I need you to uh, get some wood chopped down, and then you can sleep. So orders, chop wood. We have a wood-based economy right now. All right, it's not even an economy, it's just survival. If we could get a battery up, that would help quite a bit too. We got a tiny little slate. The plague? Really? Alright, well, you stay out there, plaguey. <sighs> you are really a problem, my dear. Um, when you wake up, could you please, yeah, okay, you can't do that, all right, Erica, after you feed Gorilla, then you come chop these trees before you research. Are you hungry? Here, eat this, put this away. All right, that's 14. Okay, that's 46. That's enough wood for him to at least build that. Now this, is this connected? Let's see, it's getting 110. So yeah, these are connected right now. It's just because there's no wind. But is it 31 degrees in here? Ay ay ay. Why are you sleeping in here? You weird, weird lady. I was hoping it wouldn't go, um, go warm before the, the windmill kicked back on, but apparently it did. Wind turbine, not windmill. All right. That's why you're sleeping in there. I knew it was my fault for some reason, but... All right, you go to bed. This is your bed, not the freezer. There you go. Wake up. Here, wake up. Now go to bed. Imperial waste drop off. Okay, so basically this stuff will pollute our area, all right. Oh, well, that's a little uh, horrendous, isn't it? Okay, so this would... I mean, this is all kind of cool stuff, but... Not something I'm going to do right this second. All right, orange is almost converted. That will help as well. I think I'm gonna just try when she's converted. She doesn't have a lot, her resistance is only 11. It wouldn't take that, oh dear, mad boom rat, let's pause. It wouldn't take that long to uh, turn her into an actual colonist. And I've got a few people, so I think I could just probably turn her into a colonist and then not have to worry about it later. All right, Mad Boom Rat. Let's take care of this problem. He can't get in. He's out there. But what I do want is this. So let's at least prioritize doing this. I don't want you taming more animals until we get this fence problem sorted, dude. Alright, chop these. 
Gorilla, I would like you to take care of this. Just get us a bunch of trees down here. Thank you. There's a lot of uh, steel here, too. I think if we leave this overnight, he'll, I want to say, stop being maddened by tomorrow. Which is sort of what I'm going to go with for now, because I don't want to deal with him right this second. Alright, he got that. Good, good. Okay, this one, and then this one. And then that won't be a problem anymore. Gorilla, you have heat stroke. Here. Go here. We'll solve that heat stroke problem real quick. What is with the animals? Is it because it's hot? I wonder if the animals have, have more of a chance of flipping out if the if the weather or the conditions outside are not great. Because it certainly doesn't help our colonists. Alright. Are you still heat stroking? Are you? No, now you have hypothermia. Okay, so. Back to whatever you were doing. Undraft. Ooh, our research is doing good, though, now. We'll have batteries by... Maybe not tomorrow, but soon. Maybe not today. Maybe not tomorrow. Soon we shall have batteries. Elsie doing? I haven't checked on her in a while. Strangler's having some issues. What's up, dude? Well, I know, the chemical dependency thing, that's not much I can do about that. Um, psychite dependency. I don't have psychite, bro. You're, you're just out of luck on that. Cabin fever, hungry. Why do you have cabin fever? Go outside. You're not locked in. You can go out. I guess he doesn't, though. He just goes here and back. And So I wonder if it'd be good to have a place where they actually have to go out to get to, like, maybe the, I don't know, the, the chess set or what am I trying to say, like a, comm a little communal area. that they go to for entertainment. Conversion, all right. Yay. Now, Orange, now that you have seen the way and joined us in the Chalisi Doctrine, You may join our town. I'm actually going to do this, and I'm hoping when we go in to recruit her, I think this is from a mod, this part, but I think that means when we go in to recruit her, we'll, uh, she'll clean her place up because, yeah, yikes. All right. Uh, can you guys get the donkey out, please? Thank you. Anybody? Uh, hooch. After you cook that, could you get the donkey back out? Thank you. Oh, uh, strangler. Hang on, buddy. You're... 
do this instead, okay? Thank you. And then haul these out. I really got to get a battery going because this is not going to be, I'm trying to get lights and everything set up and it's not going to happen with a windmill that, or why did I keep saying windmill, wind turbine that, uh, like right now, no wind, we're going to lose power, maybe. There's barely enough wind to keep it going. We're close though. Erica has been, she's really been researching. She's been trying to find that battery. Trying to figure out how to make it. She's almost there. So pretty soon we'll be able to, I could do a fueled stove. However, I think we're going to have electricity set up soon. And I don't want to make two stoves. So I'm going to make this one. And luckily, it'll reach the electricity without having to put new power conduit in here. So that's good. And let's get this kitchen set up. Because people are sick of sick of sick. They're sick of getting sick. Every time they eat. Eating potatoes too. Do we not have food? What are you doing? Hooch. Cook, bro, cook. Zorkon is training Elsie. Well, Zorkon, can you please make this and then you can train Elsie? Thank you, sir. And let's get this floor built as well. Oh, good, good. Yay. Now, I'm thinking solar panel, windmill generator. I'm going to go with the water mill, not windmill, water mill generator instead of solar. We're a cave people. We have a river. Let's go water mill. All right. Oh, son of Zorkun. I'm tempted to, uh, to nab him. Let's see. Oh, temptation averted. That's a lot of people. That's O'Neill right there. So that's his son, but I can't really do anything about it. So, Aunt Gita, so is the aunt here too? No, just O'Neill. Yeah, I wish we could, I might get a mod, a, a mod for that, just because it'd be cool if you could bring in their family, you know? All right. I don't think, oh, you know what I actually do? Let's sell out that... Ambrosia. That would be good. Alright, so... Give me uh, two seconds. I'll be right back. I've got a knock at the door.
All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. I need a little sign outside my door that says can't answer gaming. All right. 19 Ambrosia tech print jump packs. Uh Oh, okay. So this is like research if you get this, but it's very expensive, so it's not like I can afford it anyway. We're not selling any medicine. The knife. I could sell this cheap revolver if I wanted, but it's 12 silver. It's hardly worth it. But I'll sell these just so they're not clogging up our space. And is there anything we want? We could buy a few of these. Yeah, let's buy some medicine. Alright. Nice doing business with you folks. What was I doing? Zorkon's playing horseshoes. Alright, Strangler. Go ahead and clean this up, sir. Mr. Strangler. Hey. Found out this whole area, dude. Everything. And you can haul these too. Alright. If I put a floor down, they'll go ahead and clean it up anyway, so. But I figured he was there. Might as well. Now, do any of these make for better cleanliness is my question. Alright, stop running around and doing things. Cleaning time multiplier. So more time, if it was like 110, would mean it takes more time to clean, I'm presuming. And then filth, how susceptible to filthy? Okay, so 100, baseline. What else can we make? We could do, let's say straw matting, for example. Filth multiplier, 5%. That's interesting. Now, does that actually mean, no, because cleanliness here is negative one. Okay, so I was wondering, was like, does that actually mean that it's cleaner? But it doesn't. It means maybe that it doesn't get dirty as easy, but its inherent cleanliness is less than that of, let's say, wood, right? This doesn't even have a cleanliness. So... That suggests to me that they all kind of have a standard one, and then if there's a negative or positive, then it would put it up here. All right. So concrete is probably the same as wood, but it's less beautiful. It does take less time to clean, but I don't know if that's really worth it. So paved would maybe be good, right? Because it takes less time to clean, all other things being equal. What do you need to build that? Steel. Hmm. I have steel. Two steel, so it would be... I mean, I could get like this, but... 112, 114. And then these are the more expensive options. These also take less time. But they have bricks. I don't even have bricks. Alright, for now, I'm just going for the wood floor. Standard, easy. 
and we can do in here as well. All right, which means we need lots of wood. So, I need some of these trees to grow. All right, what are you up to? Gorilla? Yes, harvest the poplar. She seems like she's on that. All right, research going. Okay, it's going good. Next time I think we'll set up maybe, start setting up rooms or a better barracks because this is whew, atrocious. Orange, you are, so it's gonna take 0.3. Hmm. That'd be a lot of days. I don't know, we'll see. Maybe it's quicker if you make it nice. Let's make it nice. Nicer, at any rate. These guys are still in the dark over here, which I'm sure is not pleasant. Get rid of all this crap, guys. Come on. So, we also need a battery and some lights. Now, that begs the question, where do I want to keep my batteries? Um, I want them inside or under a roof because I had one rained on and it blew up, which wasn't great. So... But we also want, now we can move them. So it's not, this isn't a permanent thing. So let's just find a spot and put it down. So power, battery, like here. Yes, why not? All right, Zorkan, Royal Ascent. Oh, this is the, uh, all right, I believe this is the way off the planet for the royal quest line. All right, cool. So that's an option open to us still. Sorkhan, could you please build this as well? Very important, sir. Look at this, we're getting there. Now this needs to be a airlock type thing because it's going to be going outside. So maybe the door, one door here, or I guess here would look better. And then another here or like this. And that'll prevent the cold air from getting out as easy. I do believe. All right, there's the lamp and then All right, so we need Zorkun. Do I want you building this? How? You got plenty of food. Yeah, let's come build this before you sleep, buddy. And now I can move these later, so I don't gotta get them perfectly. That's about as far as we can get this up. 
to where it's wait is it still connected i can't tell yeah okay so zorkan can build those and i can't get one in here without extending the conduit now is this not connected I was under the impression when I put it down it seems like it but maybe it wasn't maybe it wasn't I must have been confused so maybe I have to actually get conduit down for it which means I'm going to have to smooth this wall right And let's do this one too, and then I can just run it up here like this. Although actually, I'm wondering if I want it here instead, and then I can run it down this wall eventually. I think that's what we'll do. All right. Now it's about time to wrap up, I think. We got. This is not. No, I thought this was close enough. This is close enough. This is not close enough. Hmm. Well, it will be close enough once this is ran down. So I think we're just going to get some conduit down this way. And then uh, probably call it. So let's do that and then we'll figure out what we are going to do next time. Let's see, first we need. Okay, good. Is Zorkon doing that? He is. I didn't realize he would. I guess he is a miner too, isn't he? He just doesn't. No, no, he's not. How'd you get that done? Is smoothing wall a construction thing and not a mining thing? That's interesting. Let's see. Reserved by Zorakon. I'm thinking it's a construction thing because why is he even set to mine? Zorakon mine. He is not. So, yeah. That might actually be better because last time I thought it was mining and I had the miner do it and it took for a bloody ever. And so now I'm wondering maybe that won't be the case. I mean, it's definitely quicker than the other dude was doing it, so... All right, um, after you cook your meal, haul this, someone already grabbed it, and then we will bring this down to here. And I'm hoping that will connect. Are you having issues, Orkun? Did I tell him to mine instead? I must have told to stop that. Hey, cancel, cancel, cancel what you're doing. No, stop it. Draft, go this way. I think I must have told it to mine instead of that's my goof. All right, well, uh, so now we need I guess we'll just have to put in a wooden wall. We'll probably put some uh, slate in there so it matches up a little better later, but... Oh, jeez, okay. Yes, yes, I know, more nonsense, cancel. Well, alright, at this point, just go ahead and take that out. And that. 
Yes, finish the job. I know I'm indecisive. So this still isn't... Or is it? Self-charging? It's self-charging. So it's not connected, is it? Hang on. This is at 1839. This is at 1839, and so this should be at 1839. Okay, so this is connected, but why is it self-charging? Is it just because... Or is it always self-charging and the 5 watt is just... That's just telling me what it does. I think maybe that's it. She's having a tantrum. All right, go have a tantrum, Erica. We'll start fixing stuff up better later. All right, now I have to put this wall in because I was a bit of a moron. All right. Well, that anticlimactic end. We did get our battery going. And this is looking nicer. This is something we need to take care of. He's going to build that. Take care of that. All right, so next time. This is going to be... Do I even need an airlock in between these two? Because this will probably be a freezer as well as this. But I don't know if I need the butcher. So we'll get this butcher area sorted. And probably this will be turned into a... Uh, this is going to be the food storage. So we're going to get this finished too. And then probably try to get a dining area started here. And then a hallway this way like this. And maybe we can get this. I don't know what this area is going to be, but we'll figure it out. But I think what might be good is to start getting some nice rooms. So that will be that. I don't know if we'll start the rooms next time. I think what I want to do for sure is get this. So we're going to get this out and then we'll go from there. All right. Well, I do hope you'll join me next time. Thanks to the O's who did. And uh, yeah, that's about it. I'll see you all next time. Thank you. Bye-bye.